fast, accurate, and every day. First Defense Weather. A good Friday afternoon, everyone. I'm Chief Forecaster Andrew Steamston with a look at your forecast. Well, if you haven't noticed lately, we haven't had much rain. It's been warm. It's been hot. And as a result, we have been officially put in to drought status as the whole thing across the southern tier, as well as pretty much the entire state of Pennsylvania are now under drought status for abnormal, abnormally dry conditions as a result of the lack of rain and all the heat and with no very little rain in the forecast. It doesn't look like this is going to be getting better anytime soon. Speaking of rain in the forecast, here's the rain forecast over the next five days and there's just not much of anything in terms of rainfall. We will have a backdoor cold front move through the region tonight, but that's not going to bring much of anything. Another cold front is going to move through the region next Monday and Tuesday and that's going to bring only scattered chances for showers. So what we need is just widespread rain, but we're just not going to get it anytime soon. Here's what's happening across the northeast. It's this high pressure system that's been preventing any rain from getting in the region. It's starting to lose its strength a little. It's going to allow that backdoor cold front to move through the region tonight, but it's just going to bring pretty much cooler temperatures to the region. Any rain showers that do come of it will be found farther off to our east with western New York once again remaining mainly dry. You see it here on future scan partly the mostly sunny skies through the rest of the afternoon out there. That backdoor cold front sweeps through the night. Even future scan showing pretty much nothing in terms of rain and we'll go right back to partly sunny skies through the day tomorrow. If that cold front does do anything, it will bring some cooler temperatures into the region. So we, at least we get some relief from these 80 degree temperatures we've been doing with and we'll have partly sunny skies through the day tomorrow, partly mainly clear skies overnight Saturday and once again partly sunny skies through the day on Sunday. Now the rest of that forecast powered by Ultimate Satellite Solutions. One last day of temperatures in the 80s today. Uh, for today, we drop down into the mid to upper 70s. For tomorrow, we'll go to lower 70s for Sunday and Monday, and we'll stay in the upper 60s to lower 70s through much of next week with limited chances for showers Tuesday and Wednesday, but at least it will be cooler.